Like schools also have to, just to continue that example, schools also have to consider the social situation of the pupils, for instance, and in charging for books or school lunches. So they also need some social or social security or financial information in relation uh, to the parents. And the, the mobility example, like who needs transportation, public transportation, who coordinates that. Um, Health-related information, pupils have allergies, diseases, they might need specific medication at preset times. So you automatically learn that you have to break out of these silos and you have to look at at, at how you interact with the diff those different communities. And um, then you get very interesting discussions as well on um, how do you deal with that? Do you, do you duplicate the data or do you set up a sharing mechanism, which is more the ideal situation, you know, one source, for instance, of medical information that schools can access, but then you get into dif difficult situations. Like, How do you manage that access? How do you make sure that not the entire school can read everybody's medical uh, risk records and medical history? That becomes complex as well.